Are you using H.265 as your encoder, but when you review your video, it's really laggy? Well, I have two really easy ways to fix that, and I'm going to show it to you in this video. Let's get started. So right now, I'll be showing you the two methods that I use to fix this problem because I did used to have this problem myself, and it was really annoying. I did two things, and it fixed the problem for me. So hopefully, it fixes the problem for you too. Now, this isn't one of the methods, but I'm hoping that this will fix the problem for you because this will be way easier. So I want you to go to settings here, go to output, recording, and then scroll down until you see encoder settings. Go to rate control and I want you to test out either CQP or CBR. If you're on C if you find that CBR is better, uh maybe try a bit rate of fifty thousand to twenty thousand, you know maybe it'll work but I recommend CQP more because it's a recording uh, since it's a recording you won't really have to deal with bit, bit rate uh, for CQP go down to CQ level and adjust this to around 16 to 25 um, right now I currently uh, prefer 18 so and then after all that you just, click, you just press OK. If that doesn't fix the problem, then I would recommend you to do these two methods that I used. So the first method is to just straight up go to your OBS Studio shortcut here uh, and right click it and run as administrator. That is all. That is literally it. All you have to do is just run your OBS as an administrator. Because what that does, when you run your OBS Studio as an administrator, it is now authorized to use up your computer's CPU and GPU, like a lot of your, like a lot of your computer's CPU and GPU. Uh, if you ha if you don't run it as an administrator, though, it is not authorized to use a lot of your CPU and it is not authorized to use a lot of your GPU. So if you're playing a really heavy game, it's gonna be really laggy because. Your OBS Studio is not allowed to use up a lot of your CPU and GPU. Now, if that alone doesn't fix your problem, I have another method, and hopefully this one is going to be the one that fixes it for you. So I want you to go to Settings here. All you have to do is just go to Windows Settings here. In the screen, go to System, go to Display, and then Graphics Settings. Here, I hope you find graphics performance preferences. Uh, here, basically in the screen, is that in all of these programs here, you decide or Windows will decide whether it will run it by high performance or by a battery saving program. Here, you want to go to choose an app to set preference and uh, choose this as desktop app. Here, you want to go to browse and look for your OBS Studio, whatever. So here you should find OBS 64 and go to add. If you don't find it, you can't find the folder. If you have a shortcut, all you have to do is right click it and go to open file location and you should find the location of your OBS studio here. So I have mine in, in my hard disk, uh, hard disk folder, OBS studio, bin, and then 64 bit. So uh, it should be same for you as well. Here again go to browse find your OBS studio and then just press add once you're once you're at add it will say let windows decide if you don't want that we want to make sure uh, that we decide so go to options here and then press high performance there you go as you can see GPU AMD Radeon that is my that is my uh, GPU right now so as you can see if we do high performance um, Windows or my computer will let OBS Studio use up my GPU or how much it wants. So, yeah, that's basically it. Um, that's literally all the two methods that I used to fix that problem. So, hopefully, it fixed your problem as well and that you will be recording your videos smoothly and beautifully. So, thanks for watching. That's all. If this problem continues for you, I would want you to comment down below and, you know, tell me the problem and maybe I can find more methods to help you fix this problem for you. So, thanks for watching again. Please like and subscribe if you like this video and goodbye.